This is Gary Hines of the three-time Grammy Award-winning Sounds of Blackness. Please stand by for Season 8 of Let's Talk to the Lord, Gospel Radio Show, created and hosted by Apostle John E. Ross. Trying to do what's right, but it does. Jesus the Christ. I am your gospel radio apostle, Apostle John E. Ross, creator and host of this podcast, lead apostle and founder of Omega International Prophetic Ministries. Thank you for tuning in for season eight and the new beginnings of Let's Talk to the Lord gospel radio talk show. In Kingdom, our guests for season eight of Let's Talk to the Lord are the Fisher Girls, Kingdom sisters Alma and Raquel from the dynamic singer-songwriter duo known as the Fisher Girls. The Fisher Girls are a gospel duo who are sisters. They love the Lord and love to share their gifts. Alma and Raquel, welcome to Let's Talk to the Lord. Thank you for having us. We're so honored to be here. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. And before we begin our interview, Alma, please share your testimony of repentance and journey to relationship with our Lord and Savior, Christ Jesus. 
When I was eight years old, I received the gift of the Holy Ghost, and I basically took it for granted. So when I was 16, I left the church. So I backslid, and I wanted to do my own thing. So um, God used my sister later to call me one night, and one of the things she said was, you only have one soul. And that was very sobering for me. It literally sobered me up, and God – you know, drew me to start coming to church regularly. Though I had not fully yielded to the Lord yet, but he drew me to start coming to church. And then when I gave up my will for his, that's when he basically reclaimed me, and I've been in the church ever since. Amen. Raquel, please share your testimony of repentance. Yes, I received the Holy Ghost at nine years old, and I'm a faith consistent and faithful in church. I would say about 2014 and 15, I became distracted and curious and wanted to be hanging with the people in the world and, you know, people that, you know, wasn't equally yoked with me and then getting hurt, getting injured and had to turn right back to God for recovery. So um, I really, even though I knew God growing up, it gave me more of an appreciation of God and more of a zeal and a hunger for God. So I'm grateful for God keeping me and protecting me. Amen. Kingdom, I will be interviewing the Fisher Girls about their new single entitled Let You Go and their new film Keys of the Kingdom by Michael Cleos Chin. So let's begin with Keys to the Kingdom. The seven keys to the Kingdom of God are faith, hope, love, forgiveness, humility, prayer, and service. When Jesus, Yeshua, said it, he would give his disciples the keys of the kingdom of heaven, he based it on each one coming to the same place of understanding that Peter had reached when he said, you are the Christ, the Son of the living God. In other words, the keys are given to the people who fully recognize Jesus as their king. Kingdom, that revelation to Peter was really God's approval of the selection of Peter. But in that same verse, Jesus declares and acknowledges God's selection of Peter, but yet makes the distinction that Peter could not do what Jesus had to do. Jesus, Yeshua, the Son of God, would die on the cross, sacrifice his life, and then resurrect, rise from the dead, and then ascend to the throne. And that's something Peter, though chosen by God, could not do for the sins of the world. And it's because of that victory at the cross that the gates of hell cannot prevail, including the dissension of the Holy Ghost. This film somewhat reflects Peter and Peter's denial of being a disciple of Yeshua. Then Peter's realization and faith in God, the one he so loved and served faithfully, that brought Peter to repentance and being filled with the Holy Spirit. Peter's belief means his ultimate repentance and confidence toward God and involving commitment to God's will for our lives and in God's truth. That's what the symbolic meaning that Jesus built his church on, himself, the true rock. We all must arrive at the same realization and understanding in our walk with Christ. So, Alma and Raquel, please tell us about your roles that you played in the Michael's Cleos Chin film, The Keys to the Kingdom. Hi. Um, for Alma, I play Brianna, and Brianna is struggling with believing She's struggling with repentance to God without telling too much of the film. Yes. Yes, and I, Raquel, I play Bianca, and she's a little wild and doesn't really believe in God and takes it like it's a joke. And you get to see her journey in discovery of learning God for herself 
and accepting God as her Savior. So uh, without going too, you know, in depth with the film, you know, you, it's like a roller coaster. And we're also playing sisters in the film as well, and we're sisters in real life, so, yes. And what is it that you hope the viewers of this film will take with them from seeing this film? We hope that viewers will have a mind to come to repentance and yes. to see the truth and the um, one of the things you hear us say in the previews, the New Age movement. So we want, um, so yes, yeah, got to see the film, got to see the film, don't want to divulge too much. <laughs> yes, and um, you know, this is Raquel. I hope that the viewers get to see God from a different point of view. It's very transparent, it's very current, it's very relatable, but what is going on to, in the day's time, director and writer, Michael Chen, he, he's awesome. You know, God is using him in this film. And I just really, you know, um, hope that the viewers learn, like, okay, this is what the attacks of the enemy is doing, and these, these are the different devices, and to be more sober and aware. Back to you, Apostle Ross. Amen. And Kingdom, the Fisher Girls are also releasing a new single titled Let You Go. So, Alma, please give us the story behind the song of your latest release, Let You Go. Let You Go is really a love song to God, and it's more of it's a declaration. Basically, it's talking about how, as Christians, we go through a lot. We suffer, and it's sometimes like roller coasters. And sometimes it seems as if it's never ending. But yes. the point of the song is, I'm not going to leave you now. You've been good all this time, and you're basically just making me better. So I'm not going to let you go now. Um, it's a declaration. Amen. And Raquel, please introduce the Fisher Girls to the kingdom. Yes, well, pray, praise the Lord, everyone. We are the Fisher Girls. Um, I am Raquel. My sister's name is Alma. We both love the Lord. We are singers. We are songwriters. We are actresses. We just serving God, and we just want to use this platform to highlight God and to magnify Him, and just to give Him glory. You know, um, we thankful for the creativity that God has blessed us with. We are storytellers in the kingdom. We are neo gospel, and um, we're just we're we're celebrating God, and we're displaying Him in a different light. We just we just want God to be glorified. Amen. And what are your social medias and booking information so that the listeners can learn how to contact you? You can find us on Instagram as the Fisher Girl. So it's V T H E E underscore Fisher Girl. And Facebook, the Fisher Girl. And our music is available on all major platforms. And you can look us up under thefishergirls.com. And booking information, it is Rainy Rue Productions at gmail dot com, and that's Rainy with an E. Amen. And please tell us about the music being featured during the podcast, Narrow Way. Narrow Way, Narrow Way was given to me in two thousand and nineteen. My pastor, Pastor Barbara Abraham, she was reading the scripture. And God utilized her to birth Nell Way and deposit it into me. And I was singing it in my spirit. And I hurry up and, you know, jot it down. So that's how Nell Way came about. And God just really blessed that film. I mean, blessed, excuse me, blessed that single. Last year, it made number one on BDS. It made wow. in the top 200 on the main billboard chart. And it also was considered for a Grammy in an R&B compilation, Who Mag? So we're just really grateful for God and grateful for God utilizing Pastor Barbara Abraham and just grateful for the success of Narrow Way. So Narrow Way highlights the broad and the narrow way. So it's, you know, showing we are doing storytelling with the scripture, like where it plays. So that's what Narrow Way is about. Amen. And Raquel, how may the kingdom support your ministry? You can follow us on YouTube. You can follow and then on YouTube is just the Fisher Girls, Spotify, the Fisher Girls. You can also, if you um, you can like, you can 
follow us on Facebook. You can book us. You can purchase our latest music, our EP, Tears That You're Here in the Valley, our single last year, Narrow Way, the single that was released yesterday, Let You Go. Yeah. Amen. And Kingdom, the music of the Fisher Girls are in rotation on Let's Talk to the Lord Radio International. Kingdom, Let's Talk to the Lord can be heard on Apple Podcast, iHeart Radio, including the iHeart Radio app on your Roku. Spotify, Alexa, and YouTube. You may download episodes from www.speaker.com. Please don't forget the apostrophe in let's. We are live every Wednesday at 6 p.m. Central Time from KingdomInfluencersBroadcast.com and 11 a.m. every Saturday from Sensational Radio. Dot net. Stream us 24-7 from the weekendchannel.tv. Please write to us at Let's Talk to the Lord at Yahoo.com. Please follow us on Twitter at Ross Apostle. Please visit our website, Let's Talk to the Lord Radio dot international. Please download our app on your Play Store for your cell phones found under Let's Talk to the Lord Radio. Kingdom, you may now ask Alexa to play Let's Talk to the Lord Gospel Radio Talk Show, and she'll play Let's Talk to the Lord Radio, Let's Talk to the Lord Radio International. Kingdom, Let's Talk to the Lord is your 24-hour station for talk news, gospel news, radio interviews, and Christian music. On Amazon, order our book, Spiritual Guidance Through Alzheimer's Disease, authored by my sister, Camille V. Porter. All of my music are available on Amazon and all digital stores and outlets. Lord, give me another chance. Featuring Sean E. Skills and Tamara Lloyd is available under Apostle Johnny Ross. And remember now, Thy Creator, featuring King David the Vessel, a new dual and doctrine, is also available under Minister John E. Ross. You can listen to our radio station on your Roku, found under the My Tuner application on your Roku. Then let's talk to the Lord Gospel Radio Station. Kingdom until next time. May the Lord richly bless you and keep you living your lives at the foot of the cross under a open heaven. In Yeshua Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. 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 Ain't no way I'm gonna leave you now Ain't no way I'm gonna let you down I'm this far, I'm gonna get my ground You're the reason why my mind is sound The pain has come around and it's pounding at my door Soon as it seems to have alleviated, here comes more. But it's for my good, it's what I previously misunderstood. Not for me to faint in the storm, but to better perform.